are you both today? Good. Hi, we're good. How are you? Very good. Uh, I I love the gauntlet that these two characters have to go through and blood and fire and wolf bites and everything else. Uh, what would you say, starting with you, Bella, uh, what would you say are their best traits? I mean, she's very independent. She's very powerful. She knows what she wants. Um, and I think I see a lot of that in myself most of the time. So I think the fact that me and hopefully a lot of other younger women can relate to Blake. What about you, Armani? What's, uh, what's Everett's best trait? I'd say his best trait is intuition, maybe. I think he kind of realizes what's going on faster than everybody else. <laughs> and, um, Don't look at me. Yeah, I think, he, I think his intuition, I think maybe his anxiety kind of helps with that because he's always on edge, so he's thinking over time. So I'd say my intuition. I do love, too, though, the way that they, they kind of bond rather quickly. Obviously, they're pushed through something rather, you know, bad yeah. <laughs> at the time, but they... They do bond rather quickly. Opposites um, attract, for sure. <laughs> what What is this show like to work on? Because obviously there's a fair bit of action that you, you both get to do, and I'm sure there's more to come that I can't wait to see next. Uh, what's it like working through it? So fun, It's dude. great. We get to do a little bit of everything, so it's like the, an actor's best situ situation because we get to do a little bit of everything. Being on a horror show, too, is just so fun because there's so much practical effects and blood and gore, and, and like you just feel like you're doing something so artistic like every day and every mm -hmm. second you're on set. And I love those... I, I think, you know, Bella, you had the one scene in the mirror with the teeth, and yeah. I just think that... That's such a great reveal. You, you both get some great reveals in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, what's it like working with Sarah Michelle Gellar? Because obviously, as both someone who's producing, but also, you know, in the show, what's, what's it like? It's amazing. I mean, she is a powerhouse. And it's great to have someone who's been on a Supernatural show, not even just um, was a young adult on a show, but a Supernatural show, because she knows exactly what it's like so she's always there for us she's always making sure that if we need anything or if we have any questions to reach out to her and having her as an executive producer is also just I mean yeah she can help make right decisions that lead us in the right direction so I think just having her in every aspect has been amazing did she have I don't know what kind of conversations you maybe had with her but did she give you any advice was there anything she kind of suggested that maybe help make a show like this so many different <laughs> conversations we've had with her. Yeah. Um, I think it's it's more just she's always there for us. Like, if we need to come up to her in the middle of filming um, to ask her a question, she's totally fine with it. I think the first time, or maybe it was the second time I filmed with her, she came up to me and she was like, hey, I want to have a conversation with you just because, you know, you're a lead on a Supernatural show and, like, I'm used to what that's like and I think you know we haven't we haven't talked enough so I want I want you to know that like I'm here for you and if you ever have any questions just come to me and we have she's always she's always texting us and she's always making sure that we're good yeah that's awesome well the last thing I ask you is what is an episode that you're looking forward to fans seeing is there something that as mm. as we get deeper in it's a real standout for either of you Ooh, uh, I mean every episode, every episode has its own different. thing yeah but what's your favorite would you say I don't know. Five is going to be really, really interesting good. to see how that turns out. And Seven is really good. Yeah, I like the first four. I mean, that's all of them. We're basically but, just naming every episode. But if we had to episode. pick one, I think it'd be five. I do. Which yeah. is, it's good because it's the midway point kind of of a show. And it, it has a lot of it has a lot of aspects that not the other. The, the, uh, let me rephrase that. It has a <laughs> lot of things in that episode that are not in the other episodes. And uh -huh. It feels almost like its own little movie. Like side story five. type yeah. of thing, yeah. And obviously the first episode is really important because we're all being introduced, and I think that one, the first episode the first really episode sets up really... the entire season. So, yeah. That's awesome. Well, thank you both so much. It's great chatting. Thank you. Day.